Hello guys and welcome back to another video. In today's video we're going to be showing you how to set up your own Minecraft server for free. Now, the first thing you want to do is you're going to want to head over to minehut.com. Um, they're my recommendation for a free Minecraft server, but there's also one other one that's okay, but minehut's better in my opinion, it starts up faster. So that one's like, I don't know, so something, I'll link it in the description of today's video. So, like I said, the first thing we're going to do is sign up. So just enter something here. So I'm just going to enter... Not enter something, enter your actual email. And then... Just enter your birthday. And then accept the terms of service and their policy. Now continue. The verification and now you're gonna want to verify that it's actually your email so switch over to the email that you signed up with and then just copy this and paste it right here now continue and choose a password which choose a password that's on my other account Never mind, I'm not. I'm just gonna do one, two, three, four, five, six, A, B, C. One, two, three. I think I just typed that one wrong somehow. I somehow messed up the simplest of passwords. So, now you have your account set up. Now you're gonna wanna set up your server itself. So just quickly pick a name for it. We're just going to do So I'm typing with okay, never mind. I'm just going to do that. I'm typing with one finger cuz I'm Okay. That's taking I'm going to be surprised. <laughs> so now you have your basic Minecraft server set up and now basically what you want to do to turn it on is just press activate. Now it'll take some time to start your server up and just simply wait that time out because it won't take too long to set up your server or turn it on. This does take significantly less time than if you were using a um, the other free server. I just forgot what the name of it was. That's why I suggest this one because it starts up the fastest out of any free server service I've ever used. So this is basically it. It'll turn off on its own after some time if no one's playing it. So just if no one's playing it for- okay. you can't scream in your message of the day so it'll just um, turn off if no one's using it it's like glitch but as far as I know there's no way to keep it online like you can with glitch so you can quickly just go through all these settings we're just gonna make it where everyone gets to play in creative player versus player, player, versus player is off Allow command box blocks because they're a lot more fun. I can't talk today. Um, and there we go. You set some settings for your server. Now you can get some more plugins. So we're just going to want to. Actually, I don't have any plugins I want. Just. We'll just get this one. So you basically have the most work of setting up your plugins and or the server done. So plugins will take the most time to set up because your server itself is set up, but your plugins will take some more time. You can actually manage your files here, like your plugins. You can upload plugins if they don't have it there to use. You can make new.
Okay, my microphone just cut out. Sorry. I keep unplugging my microphone for some reason. Um, so you can basically just upload your world and whatever. Here you can um, delete everything, which I would not recommend doing because it's pretty dangerous to do because you have to restart with everything you've been doing before. So we're just going to restart a server because we just updated it with some other things. So... You can basically just look around, see the catalog, because you can buy like different content for your game. This, this is free. This is free too. I was trying to click on one of the not free ones. So if you try to buy one of these that aren't free, you'll get this message that you don't have enough credits, obviously. But here's where this turns from a free um, server hosting place to a paid hosting place. So you can get credits for different things like buying things, but you can also get different um, server plans, which basically just upgrades your server so that more people can play it. The free plan is what I would recommend for most people that just want to play with a few friends but don't want to pay the $10 a month for a full-on server. But you can still pay the... Um, for some credits to buy some cool things for your server still, like this. Actually, you can't buy these, never mind. You can just buy some cool things with credits and stuff like that. So there is a list of all the servers that are currently being used. And as you can see, a bunch of people no longer use the free one, they just upgrade from here, but most likely your server will can just stay at the free plan as long as it doesn't get way too big too fast so now we're going to test out a server and make sure it's actually working minecraft i right over here direct connect this is my server it's invite only so And now you have your server. Sorry, it's lagging as it's spawning a little bit. So now your basic server is just set up in. This is about all that we've worked for. And then you can just play around with your server from here. Now we set it so it'd be creative. Now anyone who joins is in creative. I didn't mean to entirely close it like that. But that's about all that today's video is about. Like I said, you can change the message of the day, which I didn't really show you what that was. But that's the extent really to your server. So if your server turns off and a user is trying to play on it, it will spawn them to um, Minehut server. And then from there, it will make them um, just play your game or it won't let them play your game to begin with. Um, you get you hmm, can't talk people can start up your own server using the mine hut minecraft server so if they try to join your server and it's turned off because people haven't played it in a little while um they can turn it back on themselves without having to log into your dashboard on mine hut thank you guys for watching today's video don't forget to like and subscribe and come back for more tutorials Tell me what other kind of tutorials you'd like to see because I like making tutorials and helping you guys. That's basically all I do in my life nowadays, so school's over, COVID's canceled everything. Helping you guys is all I do. <sighs> so just comment what you'd like me to make tutorials on. That's about it. Thank you guys for watching. Have a great day.